Hello, and welcome to another Squishy Makeover Advent Calendar edition. So we got the Advent Calendar out and ready to go. Um, I'm excited for today, and I hope that we get something cool. So let's open it up. We're on day 11, and it looks like it's a little Christmas light. But before we open today's Squishy, we gotta see what people guess it is. If you don't remember, this is the silhouette, which, you know... <laughs> Um, this person said that they think it's poop, which is probably pretty accurate. This person said poop again, and they gave me an idea of what I could do with it, which is super helpful. So I'll have to keep that in mind. And this person guessed pool, but I think they meant poop because they said they think it's a fruit-themed poop. So let's go ahead and open it up and see what we get. Get to watch me struggle a little bit. Oh, I chipped my nail polish a little bit. <laughs> okay, let's see what we get. And yes, it is poop. It is a food themed one, so whoever said fruit is pretty close. Uh, it looks like it's like a cupcake kind of a situation. It's pretty cute, but pretty annoying that we keep getting poop. I think this is like the third one now. So um, if you have any ideas for what I could do with them, let me know in the comments down below. I got a couple good ideas from last time, so I'll definitely keep those in mind if I do get another poop. But hopefully, fingers crossed, I won't, because this is insane. <laughs> it's way too many poops. But we'll just have to see. Alright, let's get started. So here's our poop again. First things first, we gotta sand it to make sure the paint will stick. So let me just get my sandpaper out. And we can go ahead and do that really quick. Through the magic of editing, we're just gonna skip ahead to where I'm cutting off the seams to make sure that it's smooth and those don't look ugly in the final product. So I think so far I have used the poop to make a beehive and then I also used it to make a cupcake. So today we're gonna do something really crazy and use it to make an ice cream cone. <laughs> um, let me try and pull this off. After a little bit I realized, wait, I actually don't need to because we're just using the cone. So I'll deal with that another day when I use the top for something. So I'm just going to take my scissors and very carefully cut around the ice cream cone, trying to keep it as flat as I possibly can. And then I'm just going to clean up the edges a little bit. And then of course we got to get rid of this seam, which is kind of bad on this one. Now that that's done, it's time to glue the two pieces together. So. I found these hot glue fabric sticks, so it's fabric glue, but it's hot glue, so it'll go a lot faster. So I'm just going to throw some of that on there. I'm trying to keep it thin, but it didn't go very well. <laughs> it kind of went a little thick. And then I'm just going to stick this on there and test to make sure that it's on there good. There was a spot that needed a little bit more, so I'm just going to fill that in with some more hot glue and stick it down. And yeah, it worked pretty well. I don't even feel it in the squishy, so that's really nice. And as you can see, it's stuck on there pretty good. Like, I could definitely pull it off, but it'll stick well enough for me to get a seal around it with this yellow paint. So I'm just going to go around the edges and combine the two squishies so that they look like they're meant to be together. And now it's time to start painting. So I'm just gonna start by doing a white base coat, which you can see is gonna take very, very many layers to be able to get it up to opacity. So there's my first coat. And this one's gonna be a pretty simple design. I'm just gonna go for an orange creamsicle. So I'm starting by painting the ice cream orange, a nice soft orange color. Once I've done several coats of that, I'm going to paint the cone pretty much the same color. But since the bottom is foam, we want it to be the same texture as the top, so I do need to paint it. Um, and also to cover up any mistakes I made while painting the orange. So even though it's kind of boring, it needs done. <laughs> And now I'm just going to add a little line of cream for the orange creams coal. And that's pretty much it for this one. Like I said, it's a really quick one. It didn't take me very long to do this one, but uh, you kind of have to have some easy ones in there too with how many I'm doing. So 
So yeah, that's the squishy done. Pretty simple, like I said, but sometimes you gotta have some simple ones in there, especially with how many I'm doing, so. I think it turned out really cute and it's fun and I like orange creamsicle so I like the squishy. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's gonna be pretty much it for today. For day 12, let me show you the silhouette. So here it is. Comment down below what you think this might be and I will feature your comment in the next video. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. So thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. Um, sorry, it was a shorter video. Hopefully next week will be a little bit longer and more complicated, but not too complicated because I do have to get these videos out eventually. <laughs> but yeah, let me know in the comments what you think it is, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.